Hi guys, a lot of debate recently about what shoe to wear when you're running, minimalist or traditional. We're going to talk about each shoe individually first, and then I'm going to talk about how you go about picking the best shoe for you. Okay, so traditional shoes first. What the research shows is we will tend to heel strike in a traditional shoe, so we'll hit around about here. And there is some research starting to suggest that if you heel strike, you're more prone to getting long-term injuries like tendonitis. Uh, the other thing about the traditional shoe is it puts more pressure through your knee, your hip, and your low back. There are some positives though. We've probably adapted to this over time. I would say 90% of us are in a shoe that looks similar to that. If you've adapted to that, if you've been running for a long time, you've got no injuries, and you're not specifically trying to get much, much quicker, then I would stick to that traditional shoe. Okay, the minimalist shoe. So what tends to happen in that is your midfoot strike to forefoot strike. Uh, that's a good thing if you're trying to run quicker. It will increase your cadence. You'll get better propulsion. Because the shoe's about 100 grams lighter, you'll save oxygen over a longer run too. The negatives that the research has shown for that is your injury rate will actually go up in the first three months to the foot complex. So the forefoot bones, the plantar fascia, and the Achilles. That means you've probably gone a bit too hard at the start. Your body's failing to adapt. So if you want to transition to that shoe to become a much quicker runner, you have to do it very slowly. Okay. Uh, how do you pick which shoe to go with? So traditional shoe, a little bit more pressure on your knee, hip, and low back. Minimalist shoe, a little bit more pressure on your foot complex. If you're well adapted, you've got no injuries, and you're not looking to get much quicker as a runner, stick to that shoe. If you want to get quicker and reduce some load on your knees, hip and low back, start to transition to a minimalist shoe. Um, I want you to see a running specialist, so iMove, Running Science or Run Lab, they will match up your injury history, your foot strike and what you're trying to do as a runner and give you a plan to transition from shoe to shoe.